Right, straight back into this one. We are back. Um, we're getting our boy back, basically. They've got Wolgif, as far as we understand, and a bunch of bodies just rolled down this hill. So, everything's going well. Um, we're going to venture straight forth, though, because there is something going on here. Something over there. Rusty blades and jagged sharp trees from broken armor. Mobility. Who has the best mobility here? I shine in all endeavors. Come on, get him out. Thank you, Commander. Is that worth doing? Is every person worthwhile at the minute? Is that how it works? Let's have some fun. It's not just going to be you, though, is it? Let's be honest. Half fiend gargoyle hunter. Retreat is not an option. Ah. Oh, there's the other one. However, you did step into the range of this one. I'll rip you apart! And in the range of this one. It's always worth raging. Oh! My days! Okay. Let's get to melee with you. Can't quite get onto you, but we can get to melee. And then... I'll make short work of this! Ooh! Bloody hell, Darren. Why did Regal deal damage? Has he, has he got a... You know what? He's obviously got Kneel something. Me. Huh. And the fact he has something that does that, we're going to just deal with it. Okay. Onwards. Going up and up and up. Inheritor, do not leave me here in the darkness. Deliver me from evil. Come in. I used to pray to that fool too. What's the point? Things got so much better after I announced her. They can talk? I didn't think they'd be able to talk, to be honest. This is more fun than the Crusaders. Come on, friend. Renounce her. Come to us already. All our friends are already here. Renounce her will devour you. No. I will not fear evil, for you are with me. You are my day. Oh. We'll win, we live to see dawn. Oh. You did pretty well on your own, didn't you, there? Um, well, that's a way in, but. You'd be a fool not to go around the outside first. The Can we get the triple shots? Very cultist. Mm. He has a more AC, but if we get the triple shot and kill here, he'll take damage anyway. Beg me to stop. Oh, another one of you. Although you guys don't seem to do well against uh, smiting. Well, you don't have any smites. More ghouls, huh? Actually, that works for me, because if Wendoag now shoots you when you're there, although you might not survive this turn, suck your eye. You never usually do when we smite you. You did? Well done. Um, Out of shot my that sight. Be gone, so seal, you do nothing usually, but you hit someone, so that's worthwhile. Um, yeah, good. No match for me. Nice. Now he's got 22 AC. It's gonna be a tough one to take down. <laughs> Let's use magic. So we get right up next to him. Run them through. We'll get right up next to you. Way. We should be fine. No, that's not what we wanted to do. And I don't know if there's a way to stop. Oh well, we're just we're just we're just closing ranks now. I don't think I survived this turn to be honest, but okay. yeah. to be expected. Cultist. Die. Hmm. 
Is it worth us venturing round? I'm not sure what it was. Damn. Why would you come round here? Move What's out. the benefit to coming round here? Pay attention. An apprentice lockpick? Is, is that it? And a succubus? Mm. So sure on that one. We've both got... He's got a level damage. Cabriri Cultist. And Ghoul's most likely pretending to be dead. But... Crusading isn't that boring after all. Ah. Okay. What can we do here? That would be... What has we game must do AC resistance on saves. Both these bonuses make against like evil creatures. That does seem like it would be helpful in a situation against a ton of evil creatures such as these. And I can't reach them, but I can throw things. And then you can shake this one's bones. Nine, we'll take that. You can't quite get up to them, but we could... No, we can't, that's a full action. And that will hit... It will hit a few of them, though, actually. No, that was worthwhile, I'd say. For when when do I go come around? Finian, let's do him in. Come on. No. Oh. Okay. Um. More spells on that one. Another nine. It's not bad. Let's see if we can take that one. Nice. Right. Concentrate on that one. Never mind. Just, just kill it outright. I'll do. Okay. Are these all gonna come into melee now? Ah, apart from you. Hmm. Retreat is not an option. Ooh. Um, I will take bring that one. down the Nice. I don't know what else this does. What else do you have? That's Nothing really. Okay. Um. Yeah. Run them through. Oh come on! I will see to your demise. Oh, there's more. Back up. I can still fight. Doesn't look like you can, if I'm honest. Um, let's get a heal off on everyone. Yeah, that's what we want. Okay. The light take you. Need that one down. I'll rip you apart. Ah. Okay, we've got A hit in. Kneel before. Get that one out, get the other one. Come on. Come on. Okay, that's some damage. I need your assistance. Okay, gonna go for So Seal. Oh, they did not. They should have. Um More heal, I guess. Yeah, that works. Bring them all in. Bring them all in. Okay. Out of my way. Seems 
down that one. They're pretty full health still. Get another healing. Yeah, we're pretty good now. We're looking very good. The Inheritor, guide my blade. Um, yeah, get the shovel shot on this one. And hopefully, kill that one with it. No match for me. Third shot. Oh, lovely. It's not more of you this time. Eternal Rose, I call upon you. Oh, come on. Darren, finish the job. Lovely. Honourable judgment. If the wielder of this plus two axiomatic gnome hooked hammer has any lawful alignment, the first hit during the round they land on a creature with any chaotic alignment deals 1d6 holy damage. Any lawful alignment. Any lawful alignment. I need to know about you. I can't remember what it tells me about you. Where's their alignment usually? Character. Biography? Chaotic evil. Neutral. Lawful. He won't be getting as many attacks, but... That is his specialty weapon, I'm pretty sure, as well. And 1D, extra D6. Yep, we're going to give it a go for a bit and see how it goes. Whew, that's a lot of bodies we took out there. That is full plate, no one here as good as mine. Not a magical bow either. Nothing special there. Ooh. Welcome to the slaughterhouse. He is imaginative, isn't he? He's enjoying himself a bit too much. Let's go and sort that out then. In exactly... Oh my god, fatigued for six minutes. What if we just camped outside quickly? Is that a good idea? Probably not. But we've hit the button now. We've done it. Your confidence. Your unequaled talent for temptation. You were considered the most beautiful girl in the tribe, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, and the healthiest, for that matter. I could bear many beautiful and strong children, increasing the strength of the tribe. Yeah, I didn't think we'd manage to fail, but we did make this, this, the salad. I'm not sure how our armies... After packing up his rise after night's coming, so Seal finds a place to sit and pulls out a travel sketchbook and charcoal pencil. Seal glances in a direction, he draws on a small page with bold sprue. Catch his eye and make a dramatic pose. Yes! Thank you, but please don't. Just keep doing what you're doing. I'm going trying to capture your natural movements. Can I see it? There's nothing to look at yet. This isn't even a draft, more of a series of random sketches. The slope of your neck, the curve of your lips, your gestures. Not much to look at, but would it be useful if I start working on a real portrait? Well, I, I won't bother you anymore then. It's, it's, it's fine. Weirdo. Um, let's go in. I'm not sure how lot, you know, sitting outside there for ages while there's gargoyles still roaming around the entire area and our army's just been sat down there. But we know how long we have a negative and we have all the energy in the world. Ah. In the visage of the ghoul before you, you can barely recognise the Honourable Vesali Rathamus, your regimental cleric. His fuzzy grey beard is gone along with his other hair, and his once lively face has grown gaunt and livid. The skull of the old cleric is cracked open and wh whitish larvae wriggle inside. But this seems not to bother him at all. Heretics, dirty slaves of false gods. Carrick paces up and down before a desecrated altar on which an unholy symbol of Cribriri has been drawn. A group of ghouls has brought the soldiers to kneel before him. Renounce your idols and bow down before him who gnaws who you shall be sacrificed upon his altar. Or you shall be sacrificed. 
They have turned this holy chapel into a shrine to the ghoul overlord. This is vile. It seems the good gods aren't as powerful as they seem. If they let themselves be driven out of their own house by some half-rotted demon. Oh no, they are very powerful. They didn't just send anybody to purchase space. They sent us. No, never. Holy Armaday, hear me now. I will gladly die before I renounce you. A sacrifice. The old man's claws sink to the soldier's body, shuddering in pain. The latter whispers a prayer through his teeth. Well, who will be the first to taste flesh? Who will taste Kabiri's? Who will take Kabiri's communion? I will. A pale woman looks at the cleric. Her eyes are glassy with madness. I renounce Saren Ray. Hail to Kabiri. I will do anything. Anything you say. Cowardice. Treachery. This is what happens when an army lacks discipline. I beg to differ, Paralyctor. I believe your order's training is underpinned by the belief that the soldier should fear his commander more than any enemy. But I ask you, what hideous specimens must you have as officers to ensure your rank and file fear them more than something like this, for instance? Even you are less horrifying than the walking corpse with worms wriggling around in its cracked skull. You are wrong, Count. You only think I'm less horrifying because you've never seen, you've never been trained by me. If you like, I can arrange a session for you. I am open to experiencing life in all its variety, but in this I prefer to cleave my ignorance. Chaotic warriors, remember that your spirit is free. No demon worshipper has the right to give you orders. Yes. Well done. Oh, you damaged them all. Succeed with the diplomacy jet. The body faces the soldiers light up with hope. One of them whispers a prayer in the bright light babes and desperate church, the undead shriek with unnatural force. This chapel was a stronghold of fate for those who that worship the noble gods. Today we restore goodness to its rightful home. Your feast is over. We've come to restore order. Oh, nice. Apart from the one that changed them, we got all of them. Although they'll probably die instantly. Yeah. As expected. But, in a big group like this, if we go for the weakest one, we should get some AoE damage. Which is you, ironically. Come on, get a kill. Get away, you die. Yes! As long as they stay grouped up for a little bit, this is a huge advantage to us. Can't quite get to them. Oh, can, that can hit them, though. Get the front line ready in there. Transformed Ratherness. Dispel magic. Who do you use that on? I really don't know. Well, just... Who's weak? I'll make short work of this! Nine damage, not bad. So seal. Keep moving. Right. Ah. Oh yes, we are going in. Over there. Come on, bring them all to me. We know the plan here. We're going to take a lot of damage to make the plan work, but... Yes! Right, where's the one with the lowest AC? 16, 16, 18, 16. Who's got the lowest health? You with 16. Come on, get the kill, get the AoE. Ah, damn! Oh, damn. The plan can still work. We have healing still. We have the best healers in our party actually here as well. Press the attack. Oh, there's that extra D6 damage. This is why we're not worried, because we can heal up in a big way. may seem long-winded, but I know my plan. Actually, might 
to do some work ourselves here. Got them low enough that that AOE damage is going to do a, a nice amount more now. Um, do for now. Stay in the circle. Yes. Oh, that one hurt. Come on, survive, survive. Oh my God, we're close. Come on, come on. Boom. No. Damn it. We've not even got to the big guy yet. Damage them. And then. Yeah. Retreat is not an option. Come on. Hit him. And hit that one. Cure serious wounds. This thing refuses to cooperate. Oh, can't. Out of my sight. So we took too many hits. Be gone, feed. They'll beg me to stop. Good grief. To the fray. Huh. Oh yeah, we're fine now. Before me. Oh. I will see to your demise. Fall. First things oh, first. The waiting's never fun. Group everyone here. Skip the pleasantries. Positive energy. Positive energy. Positive energy. All right. Secondly, does anyone know what this is? I've done as requested. We succeed. The ritual sacrament is on the floor. The desecrated church it is covered by the unholy symbols of the Lord of the Abyss. Anything good here? We did get an amulet. I have agile fists. If the wearer has the weapon. Finesse feet, this ammo allows us to rely dexterity modifier instead of. Uh, I don't know who that would be best on. Oh, is that. That's party encumbrance. Your party is overloaded and cannot travel. Hmm, we have picked up a lot to be fair. Ah. Uh, is it magical? Is it one of those things that we put something on and everyone's like, oh, you can now move? Where are you wearing one of these? Whenever this amulet is uses a hex. Mm. Persuasion checks. Did that go down? It went up. Hmm. Okay, that's a lot, isn't it? There's only worth 48. Yeah, let's just, just drop all of those. Yeah. I thought they'd be worth more. Ah, we don't have Aldrich with us. 50-50. 50-50. How many 50-50s can we fail? Regal can't pick locks. Why are we trying to? God damn it, Aldrich. Really needed you here, if I'm honest. Did I miss something? Maybe. The altar exudes the last remains over this holy power once ruled this place. Downstairs. Alright. Oh, there's going to be traps in here. We don't have all drift to disable them either.
Careful now. We can't disarm it. Can we? No one stands in my way. Can't pick locks. Ooh, God. Fighting for a righteous cause is certainly right. different from a simple massacre. So if I hit disarm, does it try to make some move towards it? And performed with pinkies out. No one. Oh, Jeff! Dead flies in the cups. The food and plates turned into de dry grey smash a long time ago. What's that? Gold powder. Hmm. Is there a way to get Waldrif back before this point? I lead. You follow. Flowers, both pieces of leather. Onwards, paper shreds. You never know. Let's not lock that one. Books, more shreds and. Of that much interest. Hmm. Zacharias, you are looking swanky, whatever you are. You see an undead man dressed in the style popular among Mandevian Crusaders a hundred years ago. Though long decayed, his expensive adornments indicate high status, and the clean and functional cut of his suit places its wear in a military profession. The other man sizes you up with a lordly glance. Greetings, Crusader. You have the honour of meeting Zacharias, the Lich, the last warden of the new found sanctuary and master of this place. I sent you as soon as you stepped through the gates of my stronghold. There is something in your bag that belongs to me. Give me my wand, as, and as my oath dictates, I shall give you a gift. What's this? The Zacharias is an unholy walking corpse. The legendary hero, righteous of the righteous. The man after whom five, no, six of my acquaintances from the most pious families were named. Oh, I cannot wait to tell everyone about this. Who should I write to first? The right honourable Baron Zacharias or the Reverend Abbess Zacharia? A lich. An actual lich. This isn't a laughing matter. We might not get out of this alive. The dark energy coming from the lich draws a response from inside you, a surge of power similar to what you felt in the bandit cave, suppresses and overwhelms all other feelings and fills you with new sensations. You lose control over your own body for a moment as your hands, as if alive of their own, dive into the bag and take Sky's wand out. You would swear that it trembles with impatience like a dog too long for its beloved master. I sense that you once took dominion over the dead. Those poor dead thieves in the caves, they didn't bow to you and you punished them severely for it. My spirit hidden in the wand showed what you do and the unruly corpses and you listened. Well done. You shall make a worthy master of the undead. Hmm, I can do chaotic. If you've made yourself a lich while demanding that everyone else revere you as a holy hero and a marvellous trick, you have my respect. Yeah. Requires an evil lich path. Give him the wand. I don't want the... I don't want to go down the lich path, though. But I will applaud him. I could kill you right now for your impudence, but you will play a different role in my plans. Will you give me the wand or continue to waste my time? I want to know more about you. What exactly would you know? My feats are sung in legend. Surely every crusader knows of them. Life beyond death has been a tedious term of imprisonment in this fortress, surrounded by foolish and maddening demons. My only occupation here has been observing the crusaders retreat, further and further, losing the city after city. The day those vacant mortals gave up Dresden, I stopped calling myself a crusader and began to despise them. Hmm. How have you survived among the demons? Are you with them? The pathetic spawn are no threat to me. They tried to attack me a few times but swiftly regretted it. I grew tired of their interference and concealed my chambers with a spell. When I required a book from the library, I would go there in an invisible guise and they had no idea I was beside them. Once you're free, will you rejoin the Crusades? Become a Crusader again? Not a chance. I've already given them too much of my time and I have killed 
Enough demons. No, when we are finished, I'll be on my way, and the Crusaders should pray that I'll pass you across again. Why'd you take up the death magic, then? While I yet lived, I often thought how superior were the undead compared to the living. The Crusader army had suffered endless defeat, while an undead army would long ago have driven the demons back to the depths of the world wound. But though the dead would be the perfect warriors, they would answer to... They would answer to imperfect living masters. I needed a better solution. I studied vampires, but found them too ruled by passion and thus utterly unsuitable. And then I considered a lich. A lich is the perfect undead being. It can possess fantastic power. Its mind survives the transformation, and is, it is eternal. I envisioned an army of crusaders led by immortal liches, and I grew certain of my fate. But the process of becoming a lich takes years, and it is dangerous and tiresome. And most importantly, it is only possible for one mortal in a million. Thus I began to work on a ritual that would allow any, any mortal to become a lich. All without decades of practicing magic or even wielding any magic power at all. Of course, I had to keep this research a secret, but in the end I succeeded. And the day I, and the day the newfound sanctuary fell, I completed the ritual and became what I am today. I don't have any more questions. Um, yeah, have it, have it. What do you think you're doing? So common sense wins out. How commendable. Otherwise, I should have had to kill you. But I have other plans. For you, except this my gift. Have we met under different circumstances? I'd never even consider sharing my power, but my oath obliges me. I, Zakaria, shall hereby fulfil my vow. A worthy crusader has come and returned my wand to me. Now I must may leave this prison and you should become my apprentice. For my first orders, your master, you must truly show yourself a worthy crusader on my oath. We will not be fulfilled. I am merely wasting my time. Meanwhile, I should begin my work. I shall reach to the very depths of your soul to alter it, ready for eternity. You will not regret the path our paths have crossed. Up there you will find the master of this fortress, Nolkanef, is expecting you. This demon is so witless he doesn't even suspect I'm here, but he is strong and tiresome. It is high time someone disposed of him. I shall assist you in this. Although my own brothers in arms are long dead, their hatred for the demons is far stronger than death. They will help you kill Nolkaneth. Are you prepared to command the last defenders of the Lost Chapel and purge my fortress? I don't want to be a lich, but I'm willing to have the power of the undead to help with this bit. I am ready. And do not linger. I shall go to the library to contemplate your future. Farewell. I'll be ready when the next we meet. That works for me. If it means killing that thing easier. A devil imp summons an imp familiar. Still no Waldrif though, mind you. Hmm. We could force ourselves through the other way. But we would get hit by the trap, wouldn't we? Is there something else we could have done? Let me head back out and just see, because... Yeah, I feel like we should have been able to get him back by now, you know? Just see if I missed a path or someone lurking around. Oh, that's the 24 things I dropped. Um, cave. I missed a cave? What? So there must be a lower path then. Is it that obvious I just missed it, or...? No, it does look like it's down there. But we can click on it from there. That doesn't seem right, does it? I'm going to come out in a weird place, aren't I? Oh, have I just broken it? I hope not. Goggles. I crave your commands. To battle, my friends. Oh. 
Let's hear you cry. Well, that didn't charge us all, did it? Just walked up to him slowly. Um. I will bring down the divine wrath. Precision and grace. The light take you. This one's mine. Yeah, that hammer's doing a lot more damage, actually. Run them through. Oh. Eternal Rose, I call upon you. Not sure if I'm meant to be down here, as you know. Ooh. Oh, this is the the well. I oh, imagine you can click on the well and get down here Let's then. So this is their away. treasure area. Only you deserve my obedience. Eighteen. Eighteen. Oh, oh, good shots, though. Oh, very good shots. Okay. I'll make short work of this. Just keep doing what we can, then. No, keep him at range. It seems to be working. He has to come in close ranks with this. Might get a hit off. Yeah, that's not going to work out, really, is it? Let's skip that go, though, because. Now we're going to take an attack, but we didn't take an attack opportunity. Hmm. So we said there was nothing down here worth having, Daron, but you never know. Got a small harp. And Bruiser's Chain Shirt. This change track grants were damage resistance against piercing. And some gold. And there's more over there. Book of Dreams. The book you found reveals only a small part of its secrets, at least at the moment. Come now. What was that? Where was. Info? As your travels continue and the story unravels itself, the book reveals more of its secrets. Now all you summon creatures gain respect for the long, greater long strider and hope spells. So summoning creatures with this thing is good. It makes them stronger. That could actually go on wall drift, you know, when we get them back. I am for now. To command. 21. 21. Oh, they're getting stronger. They'll beg me to stop. To 20, though. 14. Oh. Thought we were going for the one shot. Get raging. Get some more front line in. Get some more front line in. And even more front line in. No, fuck that one up. Oops, see you. Out of my sight. Out of my way. Come on. Good. Press the attack. God, that damage against yeah. That damage against things because you're lawful is definitely doing work. Um, a tower shield, a book. Head on. A javelin. Cold iron. Could be worth it. That's only worth ten. That's only worth three. Some powder. Well, there was a lot in here, but not at the same time. You Although... What's this here? What did that do? Oh, is that the way back up through the well? Onwards. Oh, okay. I'm a bit confused by that one. We still didn't find Waldrift, but we did find a hidden cave which was not hidden but was on the map but you can somehow click it 
from down there and no, I don't think that's working as intended. Okay, let's have a deeper look all this waiting for into all this because it just seems strange that we haven't got him back already. So if there are any different paths. Okay, so this is our camp. I lead. You follow. Hello. The absence of an answer is an answer too. I don't like you guys, if I'm honest. You guys are a bit weird. Just double checking, there is no... No wall drift hidden here. That is annoying. Mm. We don't have anyone who can... We can get three traps, do we, apart from him? Unless Nenio can? Um. No, it's not going to show me all their stats here. You know what? We'll figure it out. They're going to be sprinting for a little while. It's annoying that that over there is showing as an area. Like, why has this revealed itself? Like, I can't click there with my party. I don't think. That's all the weight. No, we tried. There is nothing. Hmm. Over there? No. It is just a single spiral to get up to it. So that's what we'll do. We'll see. I don't really know what to expect. Well, I'll be honest, Waldry, if you've, you've gone down on my estimations a little bit, you've sort of messed us up here. With you in the party and the sneak attacks and the, the saving of traps, we're in a pretty good position. But without you, it appears we are quite limited in certain areas. Unless... You're through here. These ghouls have been maimed even more brutally than the others. Bulky lenses are sewn over their eyes and various tools from scissors to drills are attached to their fingers. Ooh, their bodies are pincushions for long rusty needles, threads still in them. They are paying for their work on bound up soldiers, still alive but with no strength to even moan from the unbearable pain. You won't need this hair. Ghouls don't have any. It would all fall out anyway. Yours is good though, nice and long. We'll make good thread out of it. Hair makes good thread. Well, we'll use it to sew something onto you. Too bad paladins can't become like us. The light they have inside burns away our gift too quickly. I used to have a good paladin friend when I was alive. We both got bitten. I was transformed, but he just stayed the way he was. I had to gobble him up. That was too bad. If he hadn't believed his little goddess, he'd still be having fun with us now. The living like to swing their swords. When you're one of us, you'll forget about all those silly weapons with hand doors. Better kill the enemy with your hands. Sink your fingers into their meat. Let the smell out and feel the warm blood spraying. That is what happens is... <gasps> Finian! I've seen this before. Only there was a hearth and an anvil. And no, I can't remember. Sneak up and attack. I'm not stealthy. 
that we failed. Ah, new material, even better than the old stuff. Damn it! Well, now I'm annoyed. Cool creeper. Now, let's see if we can get right up to the Huntmaster. That's what I want to do. I want to close the ranks with people as fast as possible. Another trap. Brilliant. For God's sake. Um, yeah, move up. And you have both stood next to each other. Which one has a low AC? You don't. So take off point blank. Go for the shot. Not a bad shot. Go for another shot on that one. Not a bad shot. Um, yeah, close ranks. Right, this should be easy. One. An interesting choice you made there. Right, so we, again we've got another another bit we can't Ooh, the door here though. Well Jeff Come on. Crusader, don't please me. Don't eat me. So don't please me. <laughs> don't eat me, please. I don't. I don't want that. Did you hear? He doesn't want it. Well, all right. Let him go then. Dinner is cancelled. Let's go home. What if we really, really want? Don't eat you. No one will touch you. You have my word. But first, you'll have to do something. Eat some of my meat. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it all, and we'll let you go. But if you spit out any out, we'll rip you to pieces. The soldier looks in terror as the piece of half decayed meat dangling in front of his face. Darren, are you familiar with the phrase, you are what you eat? It's drivel concocted by medical establishments to make the people spend less money on delicious foods, more money on doctor visits. But on this occasion, the adage is perfectly true. Should we try and sneak again? Yeah, we'll don't do it. It's because we haven't got Bolger. As soon as you move toward the end, they fix their eyes on you. The girls howl, but not before one of them rips out the soldier's throat. Damn it! My stealth is really letting me down here. Although, I do have a Huntmaster. Damn. He's got to get in range though. That's still pretty far back. Not far enough though to stop me getting a ride up to him, I'll say that much. Let's get up there. Now, can we get a triple shot off? Yep. Gone. Oh! My name, Wendwag. Kneel before me. God, he's good. Um, can't do much but close ranks. Uh, same for you, I believe. Yeah. Close ranks, and yeah. You. Yeah, that's why we do it. Spellcasting does not work when they're in front of you. That one's down. Let's hear you cry. Come on. Nice. No one stands in my way. Nothing special there. Some healing. Knowledge world. Just can't. Damn it. Failed on that one. Onwards. Here, don't know because we can't pick locks. Oh, is this how you would got down to the cave properly? Oh dear. Yeah, so we did glitch our way down there a little bit. Well, there is loot down here. Oh, Jeff. Damn. 
We really have run out of options then, haven't we? And we found more things we can't open because he's not with us. Maybe there was something we could have... Something else we could have done. Head on. Some other choice where we were, if we were more friendly he wouldn't have ran off. I'm not sure. Can't disable that. Can't really do anything but trigger the trap, can we? Where do you want me? Let's move Unless I can throw already. something onto it. Spells not working available. Like that. Is there a way to throw things? Just not really there. We could throw a potion. Alchemist fire at it, maybe. Spells not working like that. Oh, I need to target something with it, do I? Oh. It's not the most ideal way to clear traps, I'll be honest. Smile, the world's not ending. It's the only way we've currently got, unfortunately. Beth. Hello. Holy Omade, oh, deliver us. Deliver us from the darkness by your hand. Commander Tirabade, I don't want to I don't want to die. You won't die, soldier, you you won't die. They'll come for us, the commander is on his way. Pray with me, come on. Holy Armade, don't leave us, don't leave. Come on, can you hear? Can you hear me? Come on, speak, speak. His grows voice grows louder, crackling sound of torn flesh. I'm hungry. Oh, he turned. Do not speak. Do not waver. I mean, he doesn't look much of danger right now, if I'm honest. Commander, you came. And this is the commander of a knightly order. What a pathetic sight. You suffered a great deal, you're lucky to be alive. What lies further ahead? What lies further ahead? Staunton Vane, the fallen paladin in Dresden, is he is here with the demoness. It's a trap. Please be careful. I have the power of a lich on my side, I wouldn't worry too much. Can you walk and everyone's waiting for the Hur Hill? Yes, I'll get there, thank you. Good. Did you happen to see Wolgif anywhere? It'd be really handy to have him about now. So is the door trapped itself then? Ah. Uh, he's got good health. Speak you have. Your actions. Not your words. By your order. Oh. Well, that looked cool. It also didn't work, but I feel like it might have just killed him outright if it had worked then, by the looks of that. Hup two, hup two, keep it up! <laughs> well, how do you like my soldiers? Oh, so much prettier than yours, aren't they? <laughs> and my games, so much more fun! <laughs> the disgrace. Our camp was ravaged by an overgrown child with wings. Darling, look who's here. It's the commander. Come to return what he stole from you. It should have been you in command of this army. And these powers. They should have been yours. Oh, darling, why so sad? Oh, please, sweetheart, say something. When you're like this, it makes me sad, too. You don't want me to be sad, do you? Come on, smile. I did everything you wanted, even better than you wanted. The fools who humiliated you got what they deserved. Can you hear them scream? 
And now their commander will be torn to pieces along with them. Oh, it's sure to be a fine show. Just for the two of us. And we have the best seats in the house. This is too much. They deserve death. And what happened in Canabras was fair punishment. But this... This depraved torture... Uh, order your creature to finish them off, and we'll be done here! Sweetie, don't tell me what to do. We were too soft on them, I think. Just remember the way they humiliated you. And for what? For your part in a heroic feat? And now they would take Dresden from you? Each of them deserves a hundred deaths. The only thing unfair about this is that we can kill them only once. <sighs> They're there now. Don't pout. Kiss me, my love, and let's enjoy the spectacle. Hey! Hey! What are you looking at? Look at me! I'm right here! Do I need to bite your soldiers' heads off for you to notice me? I can do it, you know. <laughs> no, he just wants attention. I'm not giving it to him. Now go call off your puppet and come down here now. Yeah, she's the real danger. Yes. Come to us. We'll have some fun. I feel like a cave lizard that's chased a spider onto the ceiling, and now all I can do is hiss at it from below. Not that it's not enjoyable. Just stupid. But why would I ever do that? You'd better come up to me. Not all of you, of course. Just your head will suffice. Melkineth, my dear, bring me his head. Monster looks at you, and for a moment you feel once more that there is no one here besides the two of you. You feel this power, the same power granted to you. You realize that a battle is coming, the lights of which you've never endured before. But your opponent will soon realize the same. You feel his power and his fear. A moment later, the monster strikes. <laughs> Crusaders, we killed you once already. You want some more? I have friends. I don't wish to be a lich, but having this uh, slight advantage here, I will take. It's not looking good for you, my friend. Although he has some sort of awe around him, I can see. Which does look a bit troublesome. I'm not entirely sure what it does yet. But we have the legend. Let's take out these as fast as we can. Get some AoE damage so we get everyone on him. No match for me. Bad, not bad. Oh, for goodness sake. Okay, we don't want to go in just yet. I don't know what this aura does. So damaging them from outside it currently works. We have a numbers advantage. <laughs> Maybe not a damage advantage right now. We have definitely have a numbers advantage. Ugh. Missed on him. We'll prepare for battle though. We walk pretty far forward. Get prayer off and hopefully debuff them and also buff ourselves. Oh, he doesn't mess about though. We're not really hitting him either. We just wanted to get the lumbers down before we went in. That aura seems to have disappeared, though. 
But again, we shall wait for our moment. Three shots against that one. Yep. They'll beg me to stop. That does eight damage to this one as well. See? Let's draw extra allies first. With as much help as possible for this. Okay, We're almost at a point where we need to do something. Arrow of Law! They did nothing. Okay! Uh. Hitting this thing, are we? I'll rip you apart. If anyone can hit it, hmm. Is this going to be like a scripted fight where we have to go into our mythic forms to fight them? I was quite enjoying the idea of taking them all out first. It doesn't seem possible. All my allies. Precision and grace. Oh, not bad. No match for me. That one can't reach us. Well, it can, but I need to take attacks. This one's mine. Nice. You have bonuses against these. Come on. Press the attack. Come on. It's unbearable. The rules of Nalkaneth, the hissing of the ghouls, the moans of the wounded and dying. All this smells in a terrifying cacophony, an agonizing song of the tormented world. This shouldn't be happening. This shouldn't be happening. This shouldn't be happening. It won't happen. Anger, pain, fear, all emotions aside, boundless triumph and power rises deep within you. Now you feel. Rage. Rage! A blinding flash of the battlefield line up the ghouls with their bared teeth. Terror flashes across the demon's twisted muzzle and the despair on the people's faces shift into growing rage. This will leave a bruise. I don't know what that did. Am I now in mythic form? I've got too many buffs to know. Take this one back out, he's doing my edit. I'll rip you apart. 
Come on, right, you've got the perfect weapon for this. Smite, we kill it. Is not an option. Oh, come on! Oh dear. Let's hear you cry. Come on! Ah! Someone hit him! I will bring down the divine wrath! Sniper Elite! Sniper Elite! Sniper Elite! Sniper Elite. Oh. Come on, got four hits. There we go. Minato. Minato. What is this? How could this be? You deceived me, you witch! You promised I'd become... Become! How? This shouldn't have... Why? Stanton, what is this? What should we do? I can't do anything with these sores. It's no use. Darling, please do something. Uh, calm down. I said quiet. First, just get us out of here. Then we'll decide what to do. Right. Right. Let's fly away quickly. <laughs> The torturer is no more. But what happened before he died? It looked like what I heard happened at the Grey Garrison. A flash of power and a change. I've never seen anything like it in my life. There was a frightening beauty to it. Well, well. So this is how it happens. The second time, the strange power manifests. Just like in the Grey Garrison. Speaking of power, I doubt I'm the only one who found this demon, let's say, unusual. Stronger than any Nabasu ever described in the Order's bestiaries. What an unexpected sensation. Like a sip of the finest wine, a soul-sapping caress. The night was difficult, but for that ending, oh, it was worth it. Just like in Canabras. I feel a new power within me. Oh, yes. I chose my master well. I'll be damned. That power again. It's so strange. It doesn't seem like Iomade's intervention. The gods rarely interfere in mortal affairs, and never twice in a row. <laughs> She's just saying I would live on the floor. Facing the floor. <laughs> ah, did you see Nolkaneth's face? How unfortunate when your opponent gets new powers in the middle of a fight. That is unfortunate for Nolkaneth, to be fair. The rays of the rising sunlight... Uh, the rays of rising sunlight light up the gruesome battlefield. Uh, once again, you felt a strange power. The road awaits. Are we still in battle? Why are we still in battle? Is there one still over there or something? I'm so confused. Should we not be in battle right now? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Anything of use. That's of use. There of use. Nalkaneth, you have a cloak of resistance plus two. Mighty constitution. Just a plus one breastplate. And the flail of false hope. Where the real leader gets a critical hit, it restores 1d6 HP. It can be wielded only by chaotic evil. Ah, so only I would be able to wield that then, I'm guessing. Oh, you can hold it. And you can tan hold it. So only me and Wonderwag. Cloak of Resistance. What do we get? Cloak of 
Yeah, Club of Resistance plus two. You've got. Yeah, that's that's good. Resistance plus one. Have an upgrade. You've got resistance plus one. Do I have a belt? I don't even have a belt. I'll take two constitution. Warning at stacking bonuses. So they're still stacking with what? Non-stacking bonuses. I still want them. I don't care if it says they're not working for stacking. Um, who needs a belt of constitution? Probably more frontline. Yeah, I'll take that. Um, yeah, I think we're good on that. But we did get a mythic level. Mythic hero. Mythic hero is a hard set of parts, so new abilities. Mythic feet and hard to kill. You don't die until your total number of negative hit points becomes equal to or greater than double your constitution score. Oh. I want to pick D, but okay, it's fine. So this is the mythic feat. Destructive shockwave. Whenever you miss with a melee attack, this target's total 6 damage equal to your strength bonus. Oh, that could be good. You can drink potions of swift action, magic, extra feet, no, extra mythic ability. Well, what ones are there? We could do ascendant summons because we can summon the barbal. But I like the fact of missing would still do damage. That seems just too strong, if anything. But benefit double the bonuses and attack rolls and weapon focus, so I could double my great axe. Oh, that's really good as well. No, I I just think it's too good to miss people and still do damage based on strength, considering I'm just purely stacking strength. Demon kind. The second rank mythic characters that draw their power from the abyss become close to demons, gaining resist to electricity and immunity to poison. That's what we want. And now we can summon this dude. Choosing a you need to choose which mythic path you're going to follow. This choice will greatly affect the events. However, no matter what your reasons for choosing one of the paths, or be it. Did I choose it? It didn't let me pick one when I was leveling up, but it. I assume it's demon because it's given me demon kind. So. Hmm. What did you all go for then? Before we wrap this one up, deadly aim. When your shots hit the target, they do truly devastating damage. But when you use deadly aim, you gain a plus three bonus on range damage rolls instead of plus two. When your base attack reaches plus four, and every plus four afterwards. Yep. Help where I can. Sealer. You went for toughness. Excellent. You are a tank. That is what we want. Darren. Mythic channeling. Whenever you channel energy to heal or kill, it's especially potent. When you channel energy, the damage you heal increases by number equal to your charisma. Okay. That's good. You are a healer. So, so seal. Same thing. But we don't really use you when we have all just back. Destiny Beyond Birth. You no longer suffer your racial penalty to an ability score. Only races with a penalty. Okay, I don't know what his penalty was, but he no longer has a penalty. Interesting. I still don't really feel like I chose Demon Kind. I mean, I would have, but... The fact it's just sort of chosen it for me is a bit strange. Is that it? We just leave now? There's no... Did he ice fast? Um... Yeah, there's no... Look around the area, there's no doors to open, it's just... Leave?
No losses, but the Crusaders when they face legal forces. It's time to count the losses and discuss what happened. Yeah, I guess we just Onwards. head back to camp. Well, I guess we wrap up there. We got a mythic level, destroyed this pathetic creature. And we still don't know where Waldriff is. And I don't like that. He is my favourite, apart from Wendowag. But we'll find him. I'm sure he has a very, very good reason. But for now, we'll leave it there. Till next time.